So here I am with a Tenoza base. Uh, I credit the design to R.M. Matola. He's the senior editor of American Luthier Journal. And he's designed a lot of instruments, including this one. I made it, but he designed it. And we're trying to go after the double upright bass sound. Now, it's certainly not a double upright bass. It's much smaller than that. But unlike a steel string electric guitar, where you want a lot of sustain, so the note hits and then it sustains for a long time, the double upright bass has a, has a quick attack and kind of a quick dissolve, and it gives it that boom, boom, jazzy sound. So the Tenoza bass, uh, to achieve that, mimics uh, some of the materials of the double upright bass, even though it isn't the double upright bass. Uh, for instance, on the back we have uh, maple, like every violin, viola, double upright bass uh, would be as such. It's fretless, obviously, and uh, the one unique feature of this is that it does not have steel strings. So if you've ever seen an acoustic bass or a steel string bass, those would be standard steel base y, uh, uh, strings. This has uh, classical strings. So th this is actually from, these strings um, are from a standard quarter size double upright base for those of you who care, uh, they're Tomastic Spiracores on here. But they're, they're quiet. They're, you can slide your finger and it's not noisy like a steel string. And you can also climb up high without any of that string noise or even down. So it's a very quiet guitar in those respects. Uh, that, the ebony nut, the fretless, the strings, uh, the larger than most um, acoustic basses, six inches in depth roughly, uh, give it a little bit more of that boomier double upright bass sound. So I know I'm biased, uh, you know, it's a guitar I built, but I love playing this thing, to be honest with you. It sits in the corner and I can pick it up and uh, I can just play it and it kind of sounds jazzy. I don't need to plug it into an amp and I can drag it around without having to drag a six foot double bass around if I ever wanted to gig somewhere. So, hey, thanks for checking it out. It's been a lot of fun for me. I hope it's been some fun for you as well.